Amanda Wilhelm is dating Rasbin Chokoy, but she can date many better men from the 90 Day Fiancé franchise. The 31-year-old Louisiana native recently became part of the franchise when she joined 90 Day Fiancé, before the 90 Days Season 6 with her new partner Rasbin. Amanda lost her husband, the father of her two kids, a few years ago due to cancer. After mourning her loss, she began moving on and found a comfort zone in Rasbin, who she met on TikTok. The 26-year-old Bucharest native helped the single mom recover from the tragedy. As a result, Amanda fell for him, and the two formed a relationship. While Amanda may be in love, many can see right through Rasbin on the show. Rasbin has been accused of using the single mom to get to the United States. Since Rasbin is an aspiring model, actor, and fitness coach, it's easy to assume that he has no other reason for dating Amanda than to use her as a career launchpad. Also, his multiple breakups with Amanda prove he's only trying to make the relationship work until he can get his way. 10. Mike Youngquist Mike Youngquist from 90 Day Fiancé Season 7 is one of the ideal men for Amanda to date. The Washington native is the perfect age and has a well-paying job. Mike is serious, loves kids, and cares for his family. He also has experience dating a clout chaser and could probably relate to Amanda's history with Rasbin. The best part about Mike is that he is also an American and would be able to aid Amanda through tough times, as he did with his former partner and wife, Natalie Mordetseva. 9. Caleb Greenwood Caleb Greenwood is another ideal partner for Amanda to date. The Arizona native was part of 90 Day Fiancé, before the 90 Days Season 5 and pursued his longtime Russian friend, Alina. However, his journey didn't end well when Alina's racist remarks, which caused her and Caleb's story to get trimmed from the show. Throughout the season, Caleb seemed to be looking for love and tried to stay positive despite Alina's issues. He's an understanding guy who can help Amanda more than Rasbin. Again, the fact that Caleb is an American makes him ideal to date as well. 8. Ymir Castillo Ymir Castillo was part of 90 Day Fiancé Season 2 in 2014. The 28-year-old Nicaragua pop star dated Chelsea Masick on the show and even tied the knot with her. Unfortunately, his relationship didn't work out, and the couple eventually split. Ymir seems candid and has an established career as a musician in the United States. He was last in Chicago, which isn't very far from Amanda's hometown. Ymir is great for Amanda as he is a mature man who has tried to make his last relationship work despite his job as a singer. 7. Pedro Jimeno Pedro Jimeno is controversial due to his recent divorce from Chantel Everett. He likely used his former partner to get to the United States and was a scammer. However, Pedro's fans feel he left Chantel after falling out of love with her due to her family's shenanigans. If the latter is true, then Pedro did give it all to make his relationship work for over five years until he couldn't anymore. He could be a great partner for Amanda, as he's the same age as her and is ambitious. 6. Jamal Menzies Kim Menzies' son Jamal Menzies may be a little too young, but he is no stranger to dating older women. The 27-year-old San Diego resident was recently in a casual relationship with fellow co-star Veronica Rodriguez. He treated her with respect and showed a maturity that many men don't possess. Despite being 27, Jamal seems mature for his age and cares about his partner's feelings. He appears inspired by his mother, who did it all to build a great relationship with Usman Umar. Amanda would certainly enjoy the company of Jamal if they ever dated. 5. Tim Malcolm Tim Malcolm is famous in the 90 Day Fiancé franchise due to his style. He is also respected because of his history. Tim was with Veronica, knowing she was a single mother. He helped raise her daughter and even remained a supportive friend after their breakup. Tim's past proves that he's a good man regardless of how his relationships turn out. Amanda can expect emotional support if they date. 
Tim also has experience being a father figure to Veronica's daughter and could do the same for Amanda's kids, who need that. 4. Hamza Mokini Hamza Mokini from 90 Day Fiancé, before the 90 Days Season 5 was a great guy from the get-go. He cared for his former partner Memphis Smith and wanted to build a family with her. Unfortunately, Memphis broke up with him after coming to the United States and took their daughter from him. Hamza knows the pain of feeling alone and losing a wife. As such, he can probably connect with Amanda on a deeper level. 3. Johnny Chow Johnny Chow was also a part of Before the 90 Days Season 5. On the show, he dated an American woman, Ella Johnson, and was willing to sacrifice his various duties in China to come and meet her. Unfortunately, Ella cheated after Johnny couldn't go to the United States due to various COVID-19 restrictions. As a result, he split from her and went back to focusing on his life as a single dad. Johnny could be great for Amanda as he cares about values instead of outer beauty. He's a family guy and is very understanding toward his partners. 2. Michael Ilasanmi Michael Ilasanmi has been in an abusive relationship with Angela Deem for years. He has been by her side and hasn't left her despite being unable to arrive in the United States. Michael isn't on social media and doesn't care for clout. He's already miles better for Amanda than Rasbin. The single mom can probably date Michael if her relationship with Rasbin doesn't work out. Michael will get the kids he could never have with Angela, while Amanda will have a great partner who will be by her side through thick and thin. First John McManus John McManus appeared on the show alongside his brother Patrick Mendes in 90 Day Fiancé Season 9. While he initially seemed like a villainous supporting cast member, he soon made people fall in love with his candid attitude and savage remarks. After his time on the show, it was discovered that John was even better than he was on the show. He loves supporting charities, donates, and is a kind person overall. John also adores kids and posts a lot about her niece on Instagram. He could be the perfect person for Amanda to date after the 90 Day Fiancé spin-off.